This video is dedicated to all those who don't believe the prophecy concerning the popes of Rome seeking to be worshipped as a god, as Caesar was 2,000 years ago. First of all, do the popes think they are modern-day Caesars? Well, the truth is, the official Vatican position is superior papal authority and dominion is derived from the law of the Caesars. So yes, it appears they do believe they are Caesar, who was considered to be a god on earth worthy of worship. But some may look at that quote and assume I'm taking it somewhat out of context. That being the case, has any pope ever called himself a Caesar? Truth is, Pope Pius IX in his Discorsi on page 253 said, The Caesar who now addresses you, to whom alone are obedience and fidelity do. So yes, they do claim to be a Caesar. And as we know, a Caesar claims to be a god. So are there any documents from Rome stating the Pope is a god? Well, Pope Pius V said, The Pope and God are the same, so he has all power in heaven and earth. Pope Leo XIII said, We hold upon this earth the place of God Almighty. Now, notice the titles they give the Pope in this next quote. Please understand that these are also titles found to illustrate Jesus Christ our Lord in Scripture. Rome says of the Popes, For thou art the shepherd, Thou art the physician, thou art the director, and thou art the husbandman. Finally, thou art another god on earth. The title, Lord God the Pope, is found within a gloss of extravagantes of Pope John the Twenty Second, Title 14, Chapter 4. In an Antwerp edition of the extravagantes, the words, Dominium, Duum, Nostrum, Papum, or Our Lord God the Pope, can be found in column 153. In a Paris edition, they are found in column 140. Yes, these are old quotes. However, there has never been a pope that has retracted or denounced any of them as error. That being said, is it still the present-day position of the Roman popes? Well, in 1996, it was clearly stated, the Lord Pope is the sweet Christ on earth in a document released by none other than John Paul II. In 2004, it was actually stated that it seems that Pope John Paul II now presides over the Universal Church from his place upon Christ's cross. For many more statements of the popes calling themselves God on earth, see my Words of a Beast page, specifically the first section dealing with this topic. In order for this prophecy to be fulfilled in our day, we must first see the leaders of our nations performing acts of worship upon the popes. If you view my act of worship video, you will see many photographs documenting that as the present day requirement for all political leaders in agreement with the popes of Rome. Still, even though the act of worship that they perform on the popes is defined in both the dictionary and the scriptures to be just that, an act of worship, have any of these political leaders ever declared they do see the pope as a god? Mr. President, final question. Yes, sir. You said famously, when you looked into Vladimir Putin's eyes, you saw his soul. Yeah. When you look into Benedict XVI's eyes, what do you see? God. Good way to end the interview. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. My pleasure. Thank you, sir. There you have it. The most powerful political leader on the planet, the President of the United States of America, has declared the Pope is a god.